friends, welcome back to the channel. I'm Nurse Lizzie. I am super excited for today's video. Echo Health was kind enough to send me some products to find out what all the hype is about. So today I'm going to be doing an unboxing with you and find out more about this Echo Core digital attachment. It's my understanding that we can take this and turn our regular analog stethoscope into a digital stethoscope. How cool is that? So let's go ahead, we'll do an unboxing together and find out what all the hype is about. So basically what's gonna happen is I'm gonna take my regular analog stethoscope and I'm gonna hook it up to this Echo Core digital attachment, be able to connect this to my smartphone and essentially make a digital stethoscope. So I don't know about you guys, but friends, I'm super excited to check this out. So let's go ahead and get started. Very sleek, it looks a lot like I'm unpackaging a smartphone here. We have our little quick start guide right on top. We'll look at that in a second. Okay, so looking inside this box, I have a set of standard connectors, a USB cable, oh, ooh, pediatric connectors. That makes me super excited because I am a certified pediatric nurse, so I know that I can utilize this when I'm listening to my pediatric patients. The easy directions here, there's a QR code. I can go ahead and scan that. Step one, I'm gonna go ahead and create my account. I can tell you right now, just by looking at this set of directions, there are only three steps for setup. I love that. Seems simple enough for me to do, and I like this because you can select the different type of provider that you are, whether you're a student, a physician. I'm gonna go ahead and pick nurse because that's me. And I'm gonna hit pediatrics, and I'm gonna hit hospital because that's where I'm at when I'm on the floor with students and helping to listen with their patients. All right, so I was able to go ahead and download the app Setup was super easy, simple, just a couple seconds for me to get everything connected with the app, with my device. I think what's really awesome about this, when you're reading through, it has approximately 480 um, minutes of battery life. That's a really long time. If you think about when we're out in practice and we're assessing our patients, how often we are using a stethoscope, yes, but 480 minutes between charging time buys us a lot of time. What I also really love, when you get this core digital attachment, you have two different connectors. You have a standard connector and you have a pediatric connector. So I'm gonna show you both really quickly um, how simple it is for me to set up and it's interchangeable with your stethoscopes. I love that because one size does not fit all. So if you're like me, I am a nursing faculty member I teach pediatric nursing. However, I also sometimes take students to the adult med surge world. So I might be listening to the, you know, my stethoscope on an adult patient. So I now have two different options when I'm out in practice helping students. But for the sake of showing you, I'll just, I'll use the pediatric one quick. All right, let's go ahead and set this up. So we're gonna pick the core digital attachment. That's what we're working with today. Oh, I like this. I like that the directions are right there, but it's simple and everything's very, I'm visual, so everything's right there for me. So we need our digital attachment, the tubing connector, and the barb connector. And I'm gonna take my chest piece apart from the tubing. So I went ahead, I disconnected my chest piece from my tubing, so I'm actually going to put the tubing connector um, in place. You do get a barb connector. It's just a simple metal grommet that you can actually stick inside of your stethoscope tubing. And that's going to attach with this digital, the Echo digital attachment. Go ahead and put my bell back on. Once you get to this part, there's just a nice little button here that you're gonna click on. And I don't know if you can see on the camera, but there's a little flashing light. So when I first initially turned this device on, it was flashing orange, which in the simple direction guide, it tells you what that flashing orange light means, which tells me the battery is low. I now have a fully charged battery. Like I said, it'll give you 480 minutes of battery time with this device. So once you turn this on and then you're able to open up the app into your phone, it'll actually allow you to go ahead and connect your device. And that would be important to do because once you're connected, that's where the magic happens, where you actually get into the app and you're able to play um, record, you know, when you're assessing patients, um, you can go ahead and hit start exam when you're ready to do that with patients as well. So nice little things on here. You have a little circular button that means record. You have a plus sign, you have a minus sign. The plus sign will help to ampl amplify that volume 
um, for you, or you can decrease the volume. So like I mentioned, there's two different connectors. You have your standard connector and your pediatric connector. So initially I hooked everything up using the pediatric connectors to this stethoscope, but you know what? I changed my mind. I'm wearing blue. I'm in a blue type of mood. So I went ahead and put my standard connector on my cardiac stethoscope. So I'm all ready to go and put this to use. So I decided that I'm going to do what most nurses do. And I'm going to check this out on myself first, because I'm honestly just very, very curious to hear what this echo core digital attachment really sounds like um, with this amplification. So I'm going to utilize myself first and I'm going to open up the echo app and connect my device, turn this attachment back on. Let's go ahead and see what this is about. I just got done using this echo core digital attachment and I am so excited. First of all, the sound quality was amazing. This is such a nice, crisp, clear sound when you're listening. And I was just listening on myself and it, it's definitely elevating that listening, that auscultation experience that we do as a registered nurse. But let me tell you, when I was inside the app, I learned a couple things really quickly. I can record, I can record the sound that I'm hearing. Um, I can, I can go through an actual examination. I can do start exam and it gives me the prompts where to place my stethoscope, left sternal, left upper, upper sternal border, right upper sternal border, apex, et cetera. I can actually record that sound, save it into a PDF file. I can share that PDF file. I can play back what I just listened to. How cool is that? As a nursing educator, I think what makes this so fun, this echo core digital attachment, it really elevates the learning experience. Think about if you're like me and I'm teaching um, pediatric cardiac disorders and I'm talking about some of these disorders that cause um, murmurs, I can talk all day long about a murmur, but I want my students to hear that murmur. I want them to hear what that sounds like. How neat is it that I can do that with this device? Um, I think what else would be really cool is, sorry, I'm just really excited right now. I think the other thing that would be really cool is having students listen, utilizing this device on their stethoscopes amongst each other um, to really not only have that beautiful sound quality, but to be able to practice doing the exam, be able to record their findings, share their findings. I see this as a really neat moment to kind of mix things up as they're hearing different heart rates and rhythms, different sounds, not knowing exactly what things are. You could really turn like your whole classroom into essentially like a livable breathing case study. That is awesome. If you were to ask me, do I think this device is worth it? If you are working as a registered nurse, you're out working and anything in healthcare and medicine, I'm going to give you my perspective as a nurse. I have stethoscopes. I have stethoscopes that I love because they've been given to me by the people that I love. I love that I can still use those stethoscopes and add this echo core digital attachment. And again, elevate that assessment experience I have with patients. I can use it not only in the hospital and the clinical setting, but again, as I mentioned, I can really bring this into the classroom and the educational setting. To me, that is a win-win. We know that as nurses, our stethoscopes go with us. Um, they're part of our job. They're part of our identity. We wear them around our neck, all of that. And I love that I, this device, it's just mobile. It can go with me where I'm going with my students. Um, and I definitely think it has its place in a variety of settings, not just for nurses, obviously, but that's a little bit of my viewpoint in the world that I live in. So I'm so excited. And yes, I would definitely recommend this to you if you've been considering this device and you're just, maybe you're not sure um, how to implement this in your everyday life. Well, if you're caring for patients, absolutely, it's going to come in handy. But in my world, in the educational world, I really see this becoming something that I can utilize with my students out at clinical all the time. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure you hit subscribe so you never miss one of my uploads and be sure to join the Nurse Lizzie family. And don't forget to check echohealth.com for all their innovative solutions. Thanks so much for watching.